Hi guys, this is a comparison video for Fallen Legion on the PS4 versus the Vita version. The two games actually have different stories and follow two different characters on a parallel journey to claim the throne of Phenumia. The gameplay of the two games is exactly the same. You control a party of four characters and you make your warriors attack by pressing one of the square, circle or X buttons. Although the gameplay is exactly the same, the performance of the Vita version is worse than the PS4 version. What I've experienced in the Vita version is slowdown and also microsecond screen pauses during hectic battles. Now the problem with this is that during battles you need to block at just the right time to avoid damage. So having the screen slow down and having these tiny pauses in the gameplay have resulted in me missing some of the blocks which has made me incur some damage. I didn't experience any of that on the PS4 version. Admittedly I haven't played the PS4 version as much as I played the Vita version but I didn't actually find any slowdown at all in the gameplay. In terms of the graphics, the PS4 version is a lot brighter and the sprites are much more detailed. It was very noticeable when I played the game on my TV using my PlayStation TV just how much better the PS4 version was in terms of the graphics. When playing on the Vita screen it's not noticeable at all. The game actually looks amazing on the Vita screen. Another area where the PS4 version is better is in terms of load times. Most levels took at least 30 seconds to load up on the Vita, and in some cases it took closer to a minute to load the level. For the PS4 version, the load times were around 10 seconds. So clearly the PS4 version is the superior version, but the Vita version is very playable the slowdowns weren't a deal breaker for me. They were a little annoyance, but they didn't happen all the time, and so it meant that it didn't spoil the whole game for me. Given it's a 15 to 20 hour game, I personally prefer having something like this on the Vita because I know that I'll end up playing it more on journeys to work and stuff. I did have some reservations about the story and the gameplay mechanics, but you could check out my full review to learn more about that. Thanks for watching.